Taken from the dirt, created from the earth, gone to the fire. I am strong. Break me apart into a thousand pieces. I will be restored. Though Previously on Halita. This place seems to get more majestic every time we visit. The water never stops for anything or for anyone. And that's how it will remain for generations. <laughs> Many more will stand here together like we have been doing, eh? Ngo said that she and Dara used to meet here too before when they were young. Did they stop coming? <laughs> Ngo said she is afraid to come down here, afraid to break her leg, not as young as she once was. And your father? <laughs> that man still looks at Ngo like she is a young bride when he thinks we aren't looking. You mean, just like the way I'm looking at you now? Halita, don't turn away. I want us to always face each other. To be honest, not to hide what we are thinking or feeling. Agreed? You will get tired. You can't keep up the pace with me. I think. No, no. I'm coming. So, seconds up. Oh. Please. Delay is dangerous, Mr. Dabot. Since the doctor prescribed these drugs. Yes, money. I have not been able to gather the money. Please, now, please. She had a hypertensive crisis. Are you going to be able to take her to Joss anytime soon? Okay. Wallahi, I don't know yet. Um, I spent all my money on drugs, and I still have to keep borrowing to... to... Ah, Baba Halita, hmm? I can see you're stressed. And I want to help you. Hmm. I recently created my own office in Abuja. And I've been doing everything by myself. I can create a receptionist job for Halita. <gasps> she can learn the trade, earn some money, and send back to you so that you don't have to keep borrowing. I will take care of her feeding and personal upkeep. Everything. She can clear your debt. 
Is everything all right? Y yes, yes. Her salary will be 15,000 naira per month. And I'm offering four months salary in advance. Four months? So you agree? I'll always be here for you. I promise to take care of your people. I'll always be there for them. Thank you. I love you. Not dark. And she's not very fair either. She doesn't have tribal marks. Are the tribal marks necessary? Remove your earring. Okay. Please call me as soon as possible. Thank you. We'll have to cut off your hair. Nobody's going to take you looking like this. Auntie Rabi, what about the, the receptionist job you told my father? A job is a job. Bobby, you should be turning up at the office, you know, even if it's once a week. Bobby Zamani is on a five-year medical leave of absence. Five what? Five years, sis. Every breath for me is borrowed. I need more boiling time. Life's short. Grandma will understand. It is important for us to set the record straight and to be honest uh, to the public whom we serve as regards our Nerot says you want her later to come and stay with us as a household. Yes, sir. How old is she? She is about 18. Hmm. Well, if you are sure, then it's fine. Thank you, sir. You are a good man. Thank you. So, fine. This is Victor, the driver. Chief Transport Officer, Lufu Group. You are highly welcome. This is Beatrice, the gardener. Ladi, the cook. Before somebody will break something. My name is Zaha. What you need? This is Angulu, our security officer. Let me show you around, um, Halita. Kaka will do it, don't worry. She just stepped in. Oh, okay, sir. Let me just, I'll wait for her. What's your name? Halita. Halita. Nice name. Thank you, sir. Give me a glass of water when you're done with a slice of lemon. Ice cold, please. Come home, Ma. Who is this creature? She's the new help I told you about, Ma. Come. Give me a hand. That mixture. 
It's all you use on your skin. Interesting. It's fine. There must be something about this painting. It reminds me of everything I have lost since leaving the village. It reminds me of my dreams, which may never be fulfilled. My dream of healing sick people with my herbs. My dream of getting married. My dream of my mother at my wedding. Now I don't even know what has become of my mother. I am afraid. Afraid of what? Of everything. <laughs> You, like a lich, you can't stay away, right? Uh, there's no need for that, Afi. You can see she's just doing her job. What I can see is that she's doing anything she can to get close to you. <laughs> uh, she works here. Cleaning the rooms is part of her job. Let someone else do it. Definitely not unfortunate. Anyone but her. You better stick with Bobby. Because if I see you anywhere close to my fiance, the dirty Happy enough. Let's go. Are you okay? But your face tells me otherwise. What is it? It's my mother. <laughs> my parents. What's wrong with your folks? My mother is very sick. My parents are suffering. And who told you this? A woman from my village. I met her in the market today. And you believe this woman? Why? She's a close family friend. She probably just wanted to get you scared and worried. You know how envious village people can act. Mama Kim is a good person. She has no reason to lie. My mother has been very sick, and I haven't spoken with my father since I came here. Okay, then you should go check things out for yourself. What if it's true? What if my parents are suffering and all my hard work is a waste? I will never forgive myself if... Halita, nothing would happen to your mom. Productive. I'm glad to hear. Let me help you with your bag. Don't worry, it will be too heavy for you. You're just coming back from a trip. Let me help you. Don't worry, I am fine. 
Uh -huh. I was able to sell all my goods. Uh -huh. I tell you, it was shocking to me. It was as if somebody was praying in my favor. I even got new customers that we can supply in large quantities too. And see me worrying for nothing. We must celebrate this good news, oh. <laughs> hey. What was that for? This news is so sweet. I can't help but show you how happy I am. Hey, I, I was expecting you to be happy, but not this excited. <laughs> Let me help you. Oh, yeah, carry. Ah. My in-laws, <laughs> I greet you, Pa. Kai, um, I have come for my wife. Yeah. Is his wife here? Hava, Halita, <laughs> baby. <laughs> ah, you have not told my future wife to be that uh, about our wedding. Yeah? <laughs> A lot has been happening since I left. When did Kudos go mad? <laughs> Only madly in love with you. <laughs> Unfo, see the way you are jumping on Halita like she just came back from abroad. Yeah. When is ordinary village she went to? <laughs> you should have just stayed in the village, oh, because the things that have happened in this house is scary. This house is not the best place to be right now. What's happened? Auntie Nemrod had an accident. She was burnt to death. Hey. hey, I thought we agreed you need your rest. Don't just stand there. Bring it here. how he cooked all the yam on his farm and he couldn't even eat half. Long throat is not good for her. You're actually very funny. <laughs> I promise to listen to all the ways Mark smiled at you. Mm -hmm. Are you safe? Mm -hmm. Good day, ma. Ma? Ma? She disregarded him, my father. You never have control, always. I'm sorry. Get out. Now. Max, you better find a place to hide. I'll make sure no one sees you. 
At least you can handle that. Let us not have so many dead bodies on our hands. No, we agreed they were all going to die today. No other day. Okay. All right, I will await your arrival. All right. You would not understand the emotions I'm going through today. We will finally get the justice we've been waiting for all these years. Alita, you saw I was on the phone. I'm sorry, Kaka. I just heard Max talking about killing people in the house. Alita. It's true, Kaka. And, and that thing they used to use and hold the hand or share together, the one I found where Mama Wani died, it's his own. He's wearing it now, Kaka. Alita. Max is a trusted staff. Hmm? <laughs> I'm sure you didn't hear him well. It was a phone call, right? You see? You didn't hear him well, I'm sure. You see, sometimes Max likes to use colorful language to express himself. And about that coughling, he actually misplaced it a few days before Mama Uwani died. I just wanted us to have a quick talk. It's about something that's been bothering me for a while now and I decided not to leave it that way anymore. Your boyfriend in the village, how is he? I think our relationship is more than a friendship, and you know it. Look, I know you're always thinking you're just the house staff here, but the truth is, you're way more than that. I proposed your tea idea to Dad, and he likes it. As soon as we start work on it, I'll make sure you get credit and an official place at Lufu. Excuse me, who are you? Hello, Tilda. <gasps> I see you're no longer afraid of speed. I have learned to leave everything in life to fate. Next on Halita. <laughs> oh, Halita, my daughter. Oh. 